All right, so this is another Sanyo personal cassette player, or Walkman, if you will. So this was made in 1986. As you can see, this one came with uh, portable speakers. Uh, yeah, I, I remember these things from back in the day, with their uh, little tinny speakers. Uh, th this thing is pretty much brand new. I picked this up on eBay. A few days back and uh, yeah even though it's brand new these speakers suck turn the volume up full and there's just enough volume out of the speakers to hear the music <laughs> uh, the headphones are loud enough but the sound quality isn't great out of this one the MGP9 that I showed before it has much better sound quality out of it, so it must have uh, better heads or something. I recorded my cassettes with no Dolby noise reduction, and this one is uh, far more hissy than the other Sanyo Walkman that I have. So they came with these cheap generic headphones, which pretty much all cheap Walkman came with back then. Even some of the more expensive Walkman <laughs> had these things. Uh, yeah, they sound alright. They're, they're not the bassiest thing in the world, but they're, they're pretty loud, so you can get a reasonable sound quality out of them. So when this was for sale back in 1986, it cost £19.95. Here's a picture of it from the Argos catalogue of that year. And yeah, so it's another budget Sanyo, um, but this, the fact that it had speakers, made a lot of people buy them because they could listen to it in their bedroom or whatever. But there's not a lot of volume out of these little, little speakers and there's pretty much zero bass out of them. It did come with this original box. There's a model number there. And this is part of the Sportster range. The other Sanyo, the MGP9, was also part of the Sportster range. And all the instructions is on the back of the box on these. So there's no uh, pamphlet or instructions manual in the actual box itself. And it has its original poly insert as well. This thing has been used. It's not brand new in the box as it was it has been used but very very lightly if I tilt the light you can sort of see some light scratches on the plastic there but really they're not noticeable until you actually shine the light in a, the correct direction does have provisions for a 6 volt input, DC input, and these run on a 4 double A's, which comes in a little separate pack. So you put your 4 double A's into that, and then that goes into the stereo like that. And again, stop, fast forward, and play on this no rewind and you can't open the door with your finger but you can't easily get the tape out so if you press the stop button it has a little eject function which pops the cassette out you can you can do that with the door closed as well and it pops the door and the tape out it has a standard 3.5 mil headphone jack and it has separate left and right volume controls. And this one doesn't have a belt clip. It came originally with a shoulder strap, which unfortunately I didn't get with this. So that is the Sanyo MG7SP sportster from 1986 
hope you enjoyed this quick video guys um, i'll catch you in the next one